and we wish uh, all the students all the very best for tomorrow night. Now, let's uh, have a look and see what the weather's up to. Alexis, all this damp weather is very good for the giant redwood trees, but not my soul. <laughs> Yes, my soul as well. It's been really damp recently, but we will see a little bit of brightness over the next few days. A fairly grey scene at Testwood Lakes, photographed by one of our weather watchers, and another cloudy scene in Worthing, photographed by Worthing Wendy. Now, through the course of today, we've had a good deal of cloud, but it has stayed mainly dry. We're expecting some showers through the course of tomorrow. Tonight should be mainly dry as well, with a few clear spells. So tomorrow, showers, they could be heavy. There will be brisk winds in particular for coastal streams. Stretches. Those showers will be fairly scattered but may merge together later in the day. Tonight's mainly dry. There will be a few clear spells. Still that breeze coming in from the southwest. Areas of cloud. Temperatures tonight in some places will stay in double figures with lows of 8 to 10 Celsius. So tomorrow morning many of us could wake up to some sunshine. But there will be areas of cloud developing from time to time. And then the showers will start rolling in through the middle part of the morning and early afternoon. And for some the showers could potentially be heavy and thundery. These black circles are the wind gusts gusting along the coast, maybe up to 35 miles per hour. But temperatures are well above their seasonal average, up to around 14 to 15 Celsius. And the showers will continue tomorrow night, merging together to form longer spells of rain. Now for the coastal forecast tomorrow, the winds are south four to six, veering southwest five or six. The weather is rain, then showers, and the visibility is good, occasionally poor. The sea state is moderate or rough. So further showers, maybe longer spells of rain for a time during the early hours of Friday morning, a good deal of cloud, one or two clear spells, but double figures once again. So another mild night to come with lows of 10 to 11 Celsius. These are the wind gusts to start Friday. 35 miles per hour for coastal stretches. But as we head through Friday daytime for the coast, we could see gusts maybe between 40 and 45 miles per hour. So blustery along coastal stretches. Even for inland areas, the winds will be pretty brisk. We'll see showers or longer spells of rain during the morning, clear north and eastwards, followed by drier periods, maybe some showers, but also some sunshine as we head through Friday afternoon. We could see some rain later on Saturday after a dry start in the morning. Showers to start Sunday, but drying out with sunny spells developing later in the day and temperatures for the rest of this week and next well above the seasonal average Tom. Alexis thank you we're going to develop web feet at this rate aren't we? We are. Uh, that is uh, it for uh, this evening thank you for being there David Allard is here with the late news at 10.25 tonight join him if you can in the meantime from all of us have a good one bye bye for now. Good night. Good night.